New this morning, Wofford College is ready to open the doors to a brand new center for the arts. It was a gift from Carolina Panthers owner and Wofford alum Jerry Richardson and his wife Rosalind. And 7 News is Vanessa De La Vina. She's live in Spartanburg where that center will open tomorrow. Hi, Vanessa. Hey Fred, good morning. Yes, for the first time ever, Wofford will now have a center just dedicated to the arts. You can see it right behind me here. It's a pretty big deal, and faculty and students couldn't be more excited about it. Let's take a look inside. We got a first look yesterday. The building is home to a 320 seat theater that includes a full stage, an orchestra pit, and a catwalk system. There's also a two floor art museum featuring works by Sir Winston Churchill and pieces from the Richardson's personal collection. And students Students' art pieces are featured front and center in a gorgeous gallery you can see from the main lobby. If you look up, the stunning work of world famous artist Dale Chihuly decorates the ceiling. Chihuly created two sculptures specifically for this building, pulling the whole thing together as a piece of pride for the campus. We've had amazing programs for some time, um, but now we have facilities that are as amazing as those programs. And what it's going to allow us to do is recruit and retain an increasingly diverse set uh, or population of students um, from all over the country. And the building officially opens tomorrow, and it's not just for students. It will be open to the public as well. So those art galleries, that museum, the shows that will be featured here, those are all open to the public. So they're hoping it's going to become a really nice change for the whole Spartanburg community. Live in Spartanburg, Vanessa De La Vina, 7 News. Richardson family doing so much. They're also in the fall going to open the Richardson Indoor Stadium. That's the new Very home for the cool. basketball and volleyball teams. Nice. Thank you, Vanessa.